to line with the extra flow of credits that were added during previous updates, credit rewards the sources have been rebalanced and instead of focusing on just daily events, now we'll have more different sources to earn them. Special events will become a more prominent source of credits. In the screenshot is what I can get with my 2 star FXXK, previously I could get all the solo rewards of most expert races, and if I couldn't get all, I got everything but the 80k. Now I can only get 30k. From expert races, which is basically 5 times less. You guys are seriously a piece of shit. Increase the upgrade costs of all new cars by 2 times or 3 times, fine. Nerf the credits daily events, we bargained and made you revert the changes. Later you nerfed it again without a notice, fine. Nerf the credits events even more and now the total earned credits daily are only like 60% of what we used to earn before, not okay. 10k from 100k, seriously? Stop updating the game, every update ruins the game more than it's already ruined. You basically have a player base that hates you, and you don't care. You will not earn money with a player base that hates you, you will not receive good reviews from people. The only reason I actually am still in A9 is because of my club. Else, I probably would have left the game. When their day 1 update, more accurately known as the day 7 update, seemed to have dramatically buffed loot drop rates for certain activities. A screenshot by Reddit user Alagost showed that he got 11 Masterwork Rarity loot from playing 30 minutes of free play on Grandmaster 1 difficulty, and many other players were having a similar experience. Believing this was a really fun and satisfying way to earn loot, and that this was an intentional move on Bioware's part to improve the experience. But then, 11 hours later, Bioware released an update patching out the buffed loot drop rates, and loot earnings began to look more like this. With the update, players could play Grandmaster 3 free play for an hour, and not earn any masterwork weapons at all. Hey, update on what happened here. In our Friday changes, one of the edits we made had the side effect of increasing certain drop chances. This was not intended. Once we identify the problem, we changed it back to how it was before. However accidental this might have been. Nobody felt like this so-called bug tipped the balance too far off or anything, because most masterwork weapons rolled really crap stats and inscriptions anyway, but with the abundance of them increased, players felt motivated to keep grinding for masterwork weapons until they rolled something really good, but in one fell swoop all of that was taken away, and as players complained about how lackluster looting was again in Anthem, Bioware promised they'd find ways to mitigate this in future updates. But alas, it wasn't so. When the patch did finally go live later that day, the loot drop rate was once again reversed to its original drab, boring state. And now, one gander at the Anthem subreddit will show that users have had it, with Bioware's insistence on keeping the game from being fun to play. The forum is now flooded with users revolting against the studio that's now shown how much more fun their game could be twice, both times by accident, before undoing everything. One popular Reddit post had this to say about the matter. Congrats, Bioware. You are successfully pushing players away from your game. Yesterday evening, last night, was the most fun I've had in this game since the last accident of increasing loot drops. I don't think you understand how important this is for people who value their time spent on a video game. We are not going to play your game if we do not feel rewarded. 